Hi guys, it's Misha and welcome back to my channel. I've only looked at the very liberal, cringy TikToks thus far, so I'm gonna look at the other side today. But I will say, it is difficult to find these TikToks and videos in general, um, because I guess anything that's a little bit controversial that has to do with uh, more right-leaning people, you are instantly canceled, you know, deplatform banned. But we do know that all of these, you know, social media platforms, it's totally okay to keep up videos where there's a black person, for example, calling white people demons, bleach demons and devils, all of those things, uh, as you've seen on my previous videos. So a lot of conservative voices are censored in general. But nevertheless, today we're gonna search for some of these videos and see what we come up with. And then you guys decide, are the leftist TikToks more cringy? For the most cringe seen this week. I talked to a student recently at one of our woke college campuses who said she is required in every class to introduce herself and to give her pronouns. Well, I'm Ted Cruz and my pronoun is kiss my ass. <laughs> Why is that cringe? I think it's funny. It's kind of amazing because I already identified him as ass, so that checks out. Like, I'm glad he also identifies as His response was more cringe than the actual video. This is what I'll never understand about these people, right? They're an absolute carbon copy of each other. Are they not embarrassed? They all look the same, the same Trump everything, the same MAGA everything. You're literally copying each other, and then you call us sheep. <laughs> You're the sheep. We all look the same. I can identify leftist like 90% of the time by their hair color or how many piercings they have or tattoos or all of the above. Women are servants. Women don't see fat. Understand that men are superior to women and women. Alpha males are the best. Beta males. Alpha. Oh my beta, god, the alpha beta, male stuff. Beta, I hate beta, it. It's alpha. so cringy. Why did men go from this to this? We used to live for adventure and excitement. I don't like these strict gender norms with the clothes and stuff. It just encourages people to say, huh, I like to wear feminine things as a, as a boy. That means I'm trans. No, it doesn't. It's okay to be a feminine boy. It's okay. That's so true. Like saying it's excitement to go to war. No. The presidency is a man's job. I have women are qualified to be president. No. A female has more hormones. She could start a war in 10 seconds. If she has hot flashes, whatever. Boom. Haven't all wars been started by men? Yes. Got him. And I send this message to any surviving Autobots taking refuge among the stars. Single one of you that are obeying the devil's laws are going to be arrested. But every single one of you are going to get punished by God. You cannot, you cannot escape God. You cannot escape God. I'm going to say that again. You cannot escape God. Not even with the mask okay, or Okay, what the religion feet. thing? I don't think you should base you know, your argument on your religion. Okay, let's say you don't like a law being proposed. Don't bring religion into it because you telling an atheist that they're gonna go to hell or they should fear God, like that doesn't mean anything to them, okay? It, it's not a good argument. I don't know why people do this. Start going into hell, heaven, Jesus, whatever. I mean, you kind of lose those people. So, yeah. Of sin from heaven with the voice of the archangel and with the trump of God and the dead in Christ shall rise first. Do you think enemy. people will take up arms? Oh, we're going again? to. And I'm looking forward to that. We, that is our constitutional right. I would love a physical battle, but I know Who what are you going to be fighting? Elites or whatever, or the UN, the supposed UN. Yes, please. Mainstream media. Is this a QAnon thing? Hundreds of QAnon followers from across the country gathered in Dallas to witness John F. Kennedy and John F. Kennedy Jr reappear and announce that Donald Trump would be reinstated as president. They were disappointed when the assassinated president and his deceased son never showed. They called the great storm, the great awakening, and that would happen when Satan-worshipping Democrats who traffic children in Wayfair boxes, I'm not making that up, that is a core tenant of the conspiracy, uh, would be arrested by President Trump and Q, uh, or at least members of the military directed by Q. President Trump. Oh, this is a famous video. If you see this, please save us. <laughs> I don't even see our American flag anymore. Biden's talking with some kind of crazy flag. God, please save us. 
Save us from the devil, please. I just feel bad for her. I don't know what's going on there. That is very cringe. Yeah. Just by the autonomy. I don't care about the variants because of that. This all could have been said. You didn't have to sing it. Dr. Fauci, Dr. Fauci. Oh my god. Not stand up comedy. My worst nightmare. Numbers going up, numbers going up. One mask, two masks, fascinated, double fa ah! Oh, that was terrible. I don't like them putting chemicals in the water that turn the friggin' frogs gay. Oh, Alex Jones. No to okay, what? Supposed to spell right. What? Let's spell right. Do you have a marker? It's social. There is a definition. I can look it up really quick. Let me get. Do you think a gay couple should have the same rights as a? No, I don't. I really don't. I don't think it's fair. To the gay couple? Well, no, but the regular couple, they work so hard, you know, and the gay couple, they want more. They worked so hard. Do you, when you to say do more, what? do you mean equal? Yeah, they want equal in that. And that's just too much. Red Kingdom is playing, by the way. A bit much. Okay, so in conclusion, these were pretty cringy. A lot of it is just like, you know, songs and, and weird stuff. But we do see that on the TikToks I've reacted to in the past that are made by super left-leaning people. What a music of pride, what a music of pride. Sis, and you won't date trans folks. You're transphobe. How to use rat rats pronouns, dog frogs pronouns, and census. So today I'm going to be teaching you how to use John Dusk pronouns and census. So let's go. Today I'm going to be teaching you how to use John Dusk pronouns. But which is cringiest? I would still say the TikToks where people are lecturing you on their pronouns and identifying as a rat. Or, you know what's actually really unfortunate? When parents are watching those TikToks and then going home and encouraging children to transition and, and mutilate and sterilize them. I would say that poses more of a threat to our society today than um, someone wearing a MAGA hat or someone who can't spell. So I would rather watch all of that again than listen to someone lecture me on why you know, five-year-olds know that they are transgender. Good portion of children do know as early as seemingly from the womb, and they will usually express their gender identity as very young children, some as soon as they can talk. If you have any super cringy videos that you want to send me, feel free to do so. And yeah, let me know what you guys think. That's all for today's video, guys. I hope you enjoyed. Please remember to hit that subscribe button and the notification bell so you don't miss any of my videos, and I will see you all in the next one. Bye.